Semi-final one it is then here, and it's Bartosz Marslik off the inside, who's been great tonight. Leads the scorers going into the semis. Patrick Dudek going off gate two, Matt Zianowski off gate three, Premislav Pavlitsky off four. Four Polish riders ready to do battle here in the first semi-final, Kelvin. Yeah, every chance of two riders from Poland making the final. <laughs> you said that earlier, didn't you? Oh, I think my life. <laughs> here we go, I have indeed. But, um, yeah, I can't remember too many semi-finals with four riders from the same nation, but uh, that's the case here tonight in the Principality. Smarsik on the inside is favourite for me, but um, I've got to say, if Janowski gets his act together, he's hugely impressive as well. So, well, possibly the favourites here in gates one and three. Janowski three, Bartosz Smarsik, who leads the Grand Prix at this stage on 13 points. So, he's had an excellent night. Dudek on 10, that's more like it from Dudek, the world number two. And Pavlitsky, who's had a difficult time, I've got to say this is a, a much improved performance from Pavlitsky, possibly his best Grand Prix of the season. So here we go. Yep, first semi final of this then. Here we go. Great start, he's smashing off the inside gate. And now charging hard up the inside, Pavlitsky. That's a bit of a surprise, but now around the outside is Matsyanovsky. He's going to try the outside run here and just about gets the better, but Dudek stopped that yet. None of his puppets because of that well all over the place here, and Dudek has to give way. He does. The lead is with Smarslik, and Janowski is second, and it's looking like those two are going to go through, Kel. They are indeed. Smarslik took uh, no chances there at all, did he? No prisoners, rather, in the first corner, just about got there. Good move from Janowski around the outside. Those two boys look set for the semi-final. Pavlitsky really tough on Dudek, forcing his way into third place, but into the last lap, Smarsley moving on now into 16 World Championship points and sweetly into the final. He's looking like a potential winner on the night. Smarsley riding brilliantly. Well, his World Championship has been transformed over the last two weeks. Uh, two Grand Prix, I should say. Halstavik and today, he really has been magnificent. Uh, 52 GP points now for Bartosz Smarslik, yeah. and that is mainly down to his last two two rounds, his last two performances in the Grand Prix series. He's in the final, and so is Matze Janowski. Yeah, superb stuff. They were the favourites for me going into the semi-final, and so it proved. Janowski did uh, good work in the first corner, but this man, this man is looking like a winner tonight. He's going to have a good pick for the final, of course. And uh, it wouldn't surprise me at all if he goes off the inside gate once again. Smart slick and fine style out in front. Ty Wuffin and the series leader is off the inside gate here. Greg Hancock going off gate number two. Greg Cook off gate three. Who's had a wonderful night. Nine points for Cookie. And Emil Saifuganov sneaking into the semi-finals by the skin of his teeth. Yeah. He's off the outside gate in yellow. Yeah, you're dead right about that. I didn't expect seven points to be enough. I fancied it'd be nine, but uh, seven proved to be enough. Uh, so I feel enough for a little bit fortunate, but uh, hey, you've got to take that when it comes your way. And uh, who's to say that he won't make the, the final now? He's uh, more than capable. Wuffenden in the box seat. The inside gate worked brilliantly for Smarslik. Could very well be the same for Wuffenden here in semi final number two. Hancock, he's ridden well. And I've uh, got to say that. Uh, might have been a bit fortunate last time out with that, uh, with that warning on its back, but semi-final number two, here we go. Yeah. Huge race coming up here. Wolfenden's made a decent start. Hancock has had to go. What are oh, Wolfenden's Whoa. picked up that drive? Does that allow the rivals to come through? No, Wolfenden's still got enough pace and speed. He holds that line right now. Saifukanov is the man in the yellow helmet cover. Wolfenden looks over his shoulder, and Cook has pulled up at the back. Maybe that leg injury is proving a little bit too much as Hancock hangs on now, comes around the outside, gets into second spot here. Wolfenden has the lead. Greg Hancock is second, and Emil Saifukanov is in third place right now. What a ride from Greg Hancock. Saifuda not got the better of him initially, but what a brilliant move from Hancock to now steal second place away. Wuffenden out in front, the inside gate proving to be the one on in the semi-finals. He's going to pick up the win, he's going to move further away in the title chase. Superb ride again for Wuffenden out in front. Yeah, Ty Wuffenden wins the semi-final and Hancock holds on for second. This Principality Stadium goes wild. And Ty Wuffenden is now 18 points clear in the world title race, with a final still to come. Yeah, wins the final. It's going to be 21 points clear in the championship chase. That really is quite incredible. Wuffenden, absolutely brilliant. Just had that small problem earlier on in the night. 
but he's made up for that. He's won his last two rides off the inside guy. Wolfenden riding out of his skin tonight. Can he win here tonight in the Principality Stadium? Every chance. Brilliant stuff from Wolfenden. Hancock second. And it means that Smarship leads on 16. Wolfenden on 14. There in the final. So is Hancock and so is Matsyanovsky as well. Here we go, how's your nerves? Bartosz Smarsnik off the inside, Ty Wuffenden going off gate number two, Matt Sijanowski gate three, winner here last year, Greg Hancock, a former Cardiff winner, outside in yellow, and Ty Wuffenden going off gate number two. Can we see a British winner? here in the British Grand Prix. Wolfenden looking very relaxed and very composed, Kelvin. Yeah, he is indeed. It's uh, almost like a free hit for him here, Nigel, because he's got uh, he's got this 18-point lead in the World Championship, and whatever happens here, it's not going to be anything less than that. So he's got everything to gain, nothing to lose. A great opportunity for the championship leader. Smarslik has been outstanding, and he's got the inside gate. And the inside gate won both semi-finals. Must have every chance of being the winner here this evening. Has he got the composure? Can he see it through to the end? Because Janowski, Hancock and Wuffenden, they're all riding at top of top, top form. This is a fabulous final, and we've witnessed a fabulous speedway meeting. Here we go. It's the grand final here at the Princip Holiday Stadium here in Cardiff. Here we go. Smarsnik's going to hit the front early on. Smarsnik has got that lead, and he's looking convincing here. Wuffenden is second, third is Greg Hancock. Bartosz Smarsnik holding that advantage right now, and he's been brilliant oh. all night. Hank Wuffenden trying to close that gap, he hit a bit of a run there. Hancock is in third place right now, and Janowski is in the back. And Wuffenden will try everything, but Smarsnik is looking superb here, Cal. Yeah, great start from Smarsnik from the inside. Wuffenden chasing hard. Janowski all down the shape as he got to the first corner. Wuffenden pushing hard, he's keeping Smarsnik right up to his work. Janowski now getting round the outside of Greg Hancock. Can he see himself through into third place? Smarsnik with a lap to go. Wuffenden in second place, but I think Smarsnik's going to do it. Smarsnik's getting up here, no question. It's a terrific ride from the pole. Bartosz Smarsnik of Poland wins the British Grand Prix. Ty Wuffenden, though, now has a convincing lead in the World Championship. 20 points, Wuffenden leads. But Bartosz Smarsnik is winner in Cardiff. A huge moment for the young pole, but also a big, big moment for Ty Wuffenden tonight. Takes the silver medal in Cardiff at his home Grand Prix, but leads the title race by a staggering 20 points now. What an honor speedway it is. Many congratulations to Bartosz Smarslik. He is fully deserves to win on the night. Just dropping two points out of seven outings, 19 points out of 21. A massive move from Bartosz Smarslik in the context of the World Championship. Wuffenden, well, it could not really have gone better. The only thing missing is the victory on the night, but still, he will be chuffed to bits that he has such a commanding lead in the World Championship. It's been a spectacular night of speedway. The Principality Stadium once again producing a wonderful show and Grand Prix really at the very highest level. Great speedway, the gladiators now going round on their presentation lap. Smarsley low, what a night for him. He really has come good in the last few weeks.